studying mechanical engineering gives you such a wide breadth into um, different fields that wherever your interest may fall, there's probably a place for you in mechanical engineering. So whether it's automotive or aerospace engineering or robotics, all these things you can do with, with an ME degree. I've done some like electrical stuff, I've done some like programming, so it's like it's not just strictly one thing, you do a little bit of everything, it helps you discover your interest and what we'd like to pursue in the future. The mechanical engineering experience at Rose, in my opinion, is spearheaded primarily by the professors and the faculty. Those professors that have responded to emails and Teams calls at 9.30, 10.30 at night sometimes. I spend a lot of time with my students on a one-on-one -on -one basis, helping them out. In my own background, I, I don't think I ever spoke to a professor at all one-on-one. -on -one. I've seen teachers who will create entire documents just answering all of the questions that students have. I've had office hours that have diverted into mentorship sessions. You know, having the ability to, to have that sort of relationship with professors. It's academic, but it's also they do care about supporting the overall goal in terms of making you a successful engineer. Right now I have a student who I'm more than happy to talk at 10 p.m. about the job offer she got that she has to respond tomorrow to, right? Some of those connections, which I don't think happen at other schools, are possible here. You definitely build a strong bond with your classmates because it's, it's really not viable to fly solo here. A lot of people think that since this is an engineering school, it's kind of like we're all just competing against each other, trying to get to the top. But in reality, there's a lot of togetherness. In the industry, engineers were used to working together, we're used to being collaborative. And so that's kind of why I chose Rose Holman. Usually freshmen don't get experiences like this to actually use high-tech tools or participate in anything that's like involved in machinery and stuff, but with how Rose is, it gives everybody kind of like an equal opportunity to do their own project or work with different machineries. Kind of a related example is Joe and I are taking a engineering at nanoscale class right now, which utilizes the on-campus clean room, which is something that's unheard of at other schools to have it available to undergraduates in a non-major as a sophomore. We want you on those machines. That's part of the experience we want to give you as an undergraduate student. We have equipment that you can check out just with your ID card, almost like a library only for uh, equipment, measurement equipment. So again, if there's projects that you need that for, it's all at the swipe of a ID card. So the big and the kick is where a lot of competition teams are housed and we're able to use all the resources in the different design and fabrication labs to get our competition work done. Also, the Bacon Cake are open to personal projects and school projects. And so coming here, you don't have to have any of that knowledge to be able to fabricate something. You can learn how to use the tools by taking free classes. In mechanical engineering, we all learn how to use lathes, mills. Going further than that, there's classes in the Bacon Cake that you can learn welding, you can learn how to use a CNC machine. And then we have access to water jet cutters, laser cutters. And so being able to have advanced manufacturing and fabrication equipment disposable for student use. The world is our oyster in terms of, in terms of design space of what we're able to do here on campus. Mm -hmm.